two of these photographs uh, were found ripped in half and discarded on the floor. And uh, there was a disturbing anti-Semitic comment written in our visitor guest book. Toronto police are looking to identify the man in the hate-motivated mischief investigation that took place inside Baycrest Health Centre on May 30th around 11 p.m. The facility at Bathurst and Baycrest is multifaceted, offering residential living, health care and research centres. But it was the open concept museum on the first floor where the vandalism reportedly occurred. There are, you know, the obvious concerns that would come out of something like this. So there were questions about, you know, how could this happen and what are we doing? The center says the man came in through the Bathurst entrance and it was all caught on surveillance video that has been turned over to Toronto Police. Well, there's a lot of questions at this point which, which we're trying to answer as to what this person's reason was for coming in the hospital. At this point, it does not show that he came in for any other reason. There was, he did not visit anyone. He didn't make any contact with anyone. Police released this image of a suspect and describe him as 5'8", 160 pounds, with a medium built and short red hair. He was wearing a blue baseball hat, black and blue running shoes, and blue and red shorts. No injuries were reported. In the incident, the center calls rare and isolated. There's no financial loss. It is upsetting to, uh, to a number of the people that work at Baycrest because, you know, whether you're Jewish or not, we're a Jewish institution, and uh, it's upsetting. Now, the center tells me it's common that after an incident like this, they review their security features. The photographs have since been replaced. The museum is open to the public. Anyone who has any information is asked to contact police or Crime Stoppers.